today we are looking at the SmackDown vs. Raw 2008 career mode as a WWE superstar. I'm going to play this easy because I'm having problems with the PS2 controller to actually play this. So we're just going to revisit this and just have some fun, reminisce about the good old times of playing this. Probably going to play as John Cena, but we'll have a look at the roster. Like they've got stuff like King Booker, they've got Jeff Hardy, Matt Hardy is actually really highly rated in this game with a 90 there. Randy Orton is also really good there. We've got Rey Mysterio is 93. That's also awesome. We've got Triple H and Shawn Michaels. The Undertaker as well. Really high rated. But I want to play as John Cena. The reason why I want to play as John Cena is because I want to be winning as many matches as possible. Unlocking as many legends as possible too. So at least I could do a little bit of Legends gameplay. If I ever want to do like a GM mode in the future as well, then it will be good if I can unlock some Legends. And the only way to do it is by playing career mode and getting some money and then unlocking them. So let's have a look. WrestleMania 23. That was my first ever WrestleMania that I ever watched. I remember John Cena versus Shawn Michaels. Umaga versus Bobby Lashley. Undertaker versus Batista as well. So it was a massive year for WrestleMania. Probably, honestly, one of my favorites. We also had the money in the bank as well. Like, we had so many great matches in that WrestleMania. John Cena is not even talking. <laughs> Ruthless aggression. He definitely does. I love it. They got Mick Foley there as well. Stone Cold Steve Austin. These camera cocks, bro. Like, they're all over the place. They're going down like it's a Quentin Tarantino film or something. That's what SmackDown vs. Raw 2008 is all about. Extreme rules. They didn't even include Rob Van Dam in the game. I couldn't believe it, man. Man, I wish Rob Van Dam was in this game. He is like ECW through and through, this guy. They didn't even include him. What can you say? What can you say? Anyway, let's move on. Awesome. So, this is a really cool look. It's very dark, actually. All right, so Umaga, Randy Orton. And then they have this thing as well, which is like the Power 25, which is pretty cool. Apparently, where the WWE champion got progress reports and everything. Interesting. And we got the shop as well, where we can actually buy... WWE superstars, but they're locked as well, so I can't buy them until I unlock them. But I can buy people like Sabu as well, if I actually get some coins. Shane McMahon, like apparently he's in the game, which is pretty cool. Some DX, Shawn Michaels, Triple H's. There we go, and we got some movesets and everything, so we've got a lot to unlock there, which is pretty good. And then we got a couple of messages, classic. Expect some wins, okay. And we got Backlash coming up. All right, let's check what's going on. I'm guessing this is gonna be our first match with WWE. Let's find out with John Cena. I mean, no one else is gonna be able to beat him because he was literally unbeatable back in 2007. Like he went on a 200 day WWE run. Oh wow, these cutscenes are mad. Oh, Randy Orton, of course. Oh, and Umaga partnering up? I remember when Umaga and the Great Khali used to run through everyone just to get to John Cena. And they used to hype him up so much. Oh, Molina's a bad guy, huh? Interesting. Cool storyline. It's gonna be like a handicap match versus John Cena. Is this also a road to like WrestleMania storyline? It'd be cool if it is. We've got a verse. Let's see. Randy Orton in the final. Hopefully we don't get injured. Interesting. Shad versus Carly. Interesting. We gotta go this match. Should I simulate or should I play? I wanna verse him. It's good that you can at least simulate the matches. That way I can get some points and start unlocking some legends. This is CM Punk's first WWE game, by the way. I believe. SmackDown vs. Raw 2008. 
They, they've got like the backstage stuff, which is pretty cool as well. So hyped. Johnny Nitro. Man. Kenny Dykstra, if I can remember. Is that the Great Carly? Is he going to give the Great Carly a high five or something? And it looks so strange. Chris Masters, classic. How is the Great Carly so friendly? He was like the biggest mean guy back in the day. Uh, that's funny. Alright, here we go. We got the legend killer, Randy Orton, coming out. Hey, nothing you can say. Nothing's gonna change what you got today. I can't actually play the music because it's copyright, so. Dun, 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 dun. Come on, and that doesn't mean that his championship isn't in danger. If he gets injured, yeah. he might have to the title. John Cena coming out. Wow. All right, here we go. John Cena, Randy Orton facing off. You know, Randy Orton was actually a lot taller than John Cena. Let's go. Punch. Punch. Hit him with. Hit him up. Let's go. Reverse. Oh. Nice, got him down. Boom! Get him! Boom! Elbow him! We're gonna do some taunts. You can't see me. I'm John Cena. Boom! Got him! Taking him down, mister. Boom! Elbow! Should I go to the top rope? Nah, I can't even do it. Aw, oh, man. You kidding me? Oh, you can't eat that. I don't know why I said that. You can't eat that. He doesn't even say that. Oh, classic. Oh, he reversed it, mate. Oh, he got me there. He's hitting me with the reversals now. Oh, nice. I used to love these cutscenes, hey? Classic reversal right there. Oh, John Cena's getting tired. I can see it. Oh, got him. Oh, boom. Oh, reversal. He countered that. Pin. Randy Orton is a genius, JR. Juan. He's going for the pin. Two. Oh, kick out. He's, He's hitting me They're with a suplex. Reversal. Six. Another Two suplex. Oh, that's my favorite of John Cena. Where he like pumps up his shoes. He's like ready for war. Man, how do I actually do submissions in this game? Oh, hit me with the drop kick, mate. Oh, that's my favorite move, man. Oh, taking me down. And a PS2 controller is just not responsive at all. So this is, I'm I'm doing well for what I can. Like, ah oh man, there's just not much else I can do. I prefer the Xbox 360 version of this, man. Let me tell you. Ah, oh, I try to hit him in the. I can't get him in the ring steps. Pump him up. What are you gonna do? Oh, I'm going down to the shoes. Oh, the referee's now getting intruded. Oh no! Clear knockout. Is he gonna go under the ring or something and find a weapon? All right, easy. I know, I'm gonna pretty much put you in there now. There we go. Ah, oh, I didn't even go in it. Oh, outside. He's outside the ring now. Pump him up. You can't see me. John Cena. Oh, hit him with a massive finisher right there. Let's see if I can pump him up. Oh, hit him with the elbow. Oh, no. Come on, let's get it. Come on. I just want to hit him with the finisher, man. There we go, finally. Hit him with the F U. Boom! Attitude adjusted. Oh, smashed him, mate. You smashed him. No, I don't want another taunt. I just want to pin him. Juan. Two. Three. John Cena wins. There we go, the match is over. But is Umaga going to come out or something? Attack him from behind. You can't see me. You can't. I just beat you, man. What are you going to do about it? So it's basically just like normal matches. And then you get a whole bunch of cutscenes too. 
All right. Nice. Who won all the other matches? Okay. Of course, Edge is going to be Ric Flair. Okay. Nice. Estrada. What have I done? Things have gotten out of hand. Umaga and Autumn both want to be number one contender. Oh, that's no good. Molina's like, help me! Oh, and uh, Randy Orton's saying, don't mess with me. You see how, I roll. how dare you fight. Okay. You Interesting. Know. Interesting how they did it all. Alright. A rock in a hard place. That's funny. Alright. How much money did I make? Okay, I made like 16k. So... To get a legend, I need two... Let's use my calculator app real quick. Two, ten, zero, zero, zero. Divided by 16. Nine, two, five. I need to win 12 matches. 12.4 matches. To get a legend, basically. In the game. I feel like that would be easy. Or I could get like one of these easy ones like JBL or something. That would be good. What if I just like simulate a couple of weeks? Do I actually get some coins just from like simulating through? Like what if I just go straight to the pay-per-view? Like what, what happens? Okay, let's keep going. It's interesting that you can simulate on like a career mode. Did I lose or win? That's that's another interesting question. Interesting. So I would have lost. Did I lose? Yeah, I did. But apparently it was a four-star match. Or something like that. So that was good. I wasn't even on the card. Where was I? I won a match against Estrada. Is he, like, unlockable in this game? Like, how is he in the game? Maybe he's a manager only. And John Cena did win against Randy Orton there. Interesting. So apparently I've lost the WWE Championship. He wants me to audition for WWE films, apparently. Okay, so we can just simulate and literally get cash. So if I simulate, I can just literally get JBL or something like that in a couple weeks. Yeah, so I won against Carlito. Apparently I won against uh, Johnny Nitro as well. And I can't even see any of the other cards, so it's interesting. And there we go, I got 135,000 cash, so I can unlock a superstar now. I can unlock JBL. Excellent. And then I can easily unlock the costumes of like Triple H and Shawn Michaels just by being there in the game, which is interesting. There's a little rerun of what SmackDown vs. Raw 2008 career mode was like back in the day. It's a nice revisit. I will see you guys next time.